Hey, welcome to the Southern Coupa 7 today. I'm going to give you a brief glimpse of our next project. Hopefully by the time that you see this video, try that again. Blech. Hopefully by the time you see this video, you'll have seen our dining room makeover. Um, but now we're getting ready to start a new project. Some do-it-yourself projects, home projects. Um, I come up with all the ideas and then my wonderful hubby takes on the challenge. <laughs> but this is our next one. Uh, one of it has already been started. We have this built-in desk in the little cubby here. I had a humongous organizer right here that held a lot of our school papers and puzzles and such and it was just so big and bulky. I loved it. Loved it. Loved it. Loved it. But it took up the whole space here and I didn't have enough room to get to our bulletin board and some of the big kids, well two of the big kids are starting to have some leg issues on the school table here so we thought maybe we could just add in a bigger desk here for them so eventually we're going to have the two bigger kids here and we're going to have the printer and they're going to have their little computers here and we'll probably put um, our computer here, well, maybe over there at my desk, which I'm not even going to show you that because that's a whole nother story. But there, there is, it's going to happen. Today, this is where I am getting ready to take all of this out. This humongous, gigantic, stuffed closet is so full of uh, construction paper, bulletin board, papers, stickers, blocks, puzzles, paints, you name it, it's likely to be yarn. I see yarn right there. Any kind of gadgets and gadget that I have even, I have collected over the years for different projects. I even have two sewing machines down there in the bottom. So anything you can think of that I've collected for school projects, it is now stuff in this closet. So daddy is going to make potentially four shelves. We're gonna start with three and see how that looks because I need to have enough space down bottom for uh, the sewing machines to fit and even potentially this drawer that I have right here. But we may be getting rid of that too. I don't know, we'll see. So those are these plastic shelves. These shelves, they're coming out and we're gonna get some. I'll include a picture right here. Of Daddy working late last night to stain the shelves. So it's going to match the stain is going to match this color of this desk right here. And then um, also I can tell you we actually bought these little cubicles at Big Lots. Of course this week we noticed they actually have them on sale for buy one get one half off. They didn't have them on sale when we bought them. But anyway, so this is the beginning. I'm going to start cleaning out all of this good stuff. May even have to throw some away. Who knows? It's probably, as long as we've been homeschooling now, it's probably needing to be trashed anyway. So I'm going to pull out some of this and stay tuned. Okay, the closet has been cleaned out. Next step, I'm going to take these lovely big boys out of here. There's two of them. I'm going to take both of these out. And then I'm going to let the hubby do his thing. But... There was a ton of stuff. I won't show you what the rest of this room looks like because it is everywhere. I didn't realize I had like hmm, 50 to 60 containers of Play-Doh. Between me and then my mother-in-law, she used to teach fifth grade. Um, so she kind of has helped us along the way pick up some school supplies as well. So between me buying stuff and then occasionally she buys stuff, we ended up having a very large collection of Play-Doh. Good thing they like a lot of Play-Doh. We use that a lot. But anyway, um, we have a ton of supplies also to go through before we reorganize this. But this is the start. So this is a do-it-yourself makeover. And I can take you out right now with me. And you can see the shelves that are stained. All right. Here's one that he did last night. Here's two. Isn't that pretty? I love that stained color. And then there is number three. You can see. Yep, there it is. It's on there. Okay, so I think he is going to measure to make sure he gets the 
correct length on there. I don't think he's already done that. Anyway, he's going to cut and get those set and ready and then we're going to install them into the new closet. All right, we're going to finish up the video with our home improvement, do-it-yourself, closet renovation. I'm going to show you. So, ooh, big sis over there. She's making her. So, this is the closet that I was showing you in the front part of the video that we renovated. Say so we. The daddy. Woo! What are you doing? The daddy, um, daddy built some new shelving for it. So now I've got all of our school things organized so nicely. I'm hoping I'm going to aim this right. If you need to. Okay, so give you a long view here of the whole closet. He put in three new shelves. And this is actually something I had from the nursery before that I'm just keeping to store little uh, knickknacks in for projects this is paper towels these are little paint smocks for the little guys and then up oh, this is an empty one that will probably soon be filled and these are just odds and ends that i have up here okay and then up here i have everything organized by section like this is a uh if i can film it yep art drawer this is a spelling drawer i have beads and different kinds of things with letters on it up top is yarn we have a sight word game this is a music box of cds this is a science kit that goes with our science puzzles these are those fun little balls that you put in water and they swell up sand money abc flashcards more puzzles because i am a puzzle collector i'm hoping to label all of these boxes along the way too i haven't done that yet but some of them we do have label the beans with measuring cups the lentil beans that they like to play in these are little trays with rice in it for uh the preschool handwriting then these are big kids handwriting it has some of their writing supplies more cards i guess i collect cards too all of our paint supplies are here under here are bean bags sight word games any kind of flashcards you can think of are right there glue a map puzzle and then down here i wanted this bottom shelf to be a shelf where they could reach and let's see could you show our camera where's the game box the game box where you can get games that's it so there's games in here that he can play with or anybody can play with there's um all ages games in here so these are things like if they don't ooh, as a matter of fact they're playing one now i can't remember what that whoops what that game is called okay try that again i i lost you for a second okay so he's don't okay, kick him he's down here in the floor playing one of the games that comes out of here oh now i called you little mac and i'm sorry your name is little romeo I guess sometimes I don't know my kids' names. Little Mac okay. Junior. Little Mac Junior. Mm -hmm. What's your name? What does mommy call you for Southern Koopa Seven? Little Mac Junior. No. Yeah. Yeah, Romeo. That's it. Hey. Queen. I I hope so, mommy. I will be your Mac Junior. I know. I'm sorry. I called you the wrong name. Goodbye. <laughs> hey. Goodbye. Hey. We've, we've, we've been learning Bible verses to go with each one of our letters. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to do a whole vlog on just little Romeo doing A through Z. He's learned A through M already. Okay. Okay, that's a good shot of your eyeballs. Hey, could you do your M verse? No. My. So far, with things all alone. My. So fine, with things my so <laughs> my soul finds my rest in God alone. Knows. My salvation it comes home from him. That's it. Hanging. Okay, dude, that's enough eyeball shots. God okay. alone. So here's our. Oh, I have these drawers too down here. They have big blocks, more puzzles, and then down bottom is some of the 
bigger puzzles and our glue dots fell out. Whoops. So, that is it. Daddy is sitting Thank over you, there. Good, Good job, Daddy. Anything to say about your renovation closet project? Was it hard? Easy? Easy. Easy? It wasn't hard. If I can do it, it must be easy. Lots of confidence over there. All right, quick clean up of those cars. We've got some things to do. Okay, so I'm not going to forget. What do we need to say to close us out here? Bye. You say it. Bye. No, we want. We need more subscribers. So uh, subscribe, please. Subscribe. Please. <laughs> subscribe us and like it, like it, like it, like it. Like it. Okay, little ladybug, can you say bye-bye? Mom! Ladybug! Mom! Can you say bye-bye? Mom!